那我们非常期待北京中轴线能够把它的历史文化价值充分展现出来。Beijing is like a, a service station on this expressway. Now I, I feel like I'm just a, a Beijing boy. 大家国庆节快乐！国庆快乐！也是我们幸福的一天。国庆节快乐！My name is Justin, and I'm from the United States. I first moved to Beijing in 2007. I come from a mixed family, so my father is from Zhuhai. And growing up, I always had inspiration from, I think, that two-culture family to explore my Chinese heritage a little more. What we do here is we make. Classical menswear, so everything from tailored clothing to ready-to-wear shirts. I know internationally there's something called the tweed ride. It's a bunch of people dress up in suits or tweed and get on their bikes and do a ride together. It inspired me to host our own suit geek ride here in Beijing. There's three gears. This is a little broken. Oh, One is the easiest, and then three gives you a little bit easier for the ride. Maybe you can try it. Pretty good. The main reasons we did that was to, I wanted to promote the sustainability. How easy it is to just turn off the car and just hop on a bike and ride five, ten, fifteen kilometers in a day, and also it's good for your health. Another reason I wanted to do it was to sort of. Show people that hey, you can wear a suit, dress nice, and ride a bike. Help being uncomfortable, and I'm sure it makes people around you that see you think, hey, that's pretty cool. Our first stop was Gulo, and it, it's actually one of the places that my wife and I uh, used to walk around or go to in some of our first dates here in Beijing. And I love going there and thinking about those times. Speaking of riding bikes, I do remember I was at a rooftop bar in Hohai the first time I heard the song come on called "Nine Million Bicycles in Beijing," and I thought, "Yeah, this is a very Beijing song," and it it made me reminisce a little bit about like old photos I saw, black and white photos with、uh, one or two lanes wide, people on bicycles, and I thought, "What a what an amazing time." When I first arrived here, I remember during October, there was a week-long holiday, and here in Beijing, a lot of the leaves and the sun turns very golden and rich in color. So it's a very good feeling, even though we're saying goodbye to summer and hello to autumn. Some of my favorite routes to ride in Beijing are actually through the Hutong, and in the Hutong, you have a lot of really creative spaces, whether it's little cafes, restaurants, historical locations. So I really, really recommend riding a bike through the Hutong. I really like to seeing the bicycle come back to Beijing. It's the perfect city to ride in in terms of weather. Geographically, it's a very flat topography, and it's just a really nice way to see things. Even when I ride my bike on the same route, I see more new things every day. And I do think people are starting to slow down a little bit and think about what's important for them in their life. And、that's why there's this buzzword lifestyle or lifestyle choice, and I think it's very rewarding for those individuals that do make that choice. And I hope more people do it.